What's up, ladies and gentlemen? We are back here in the Camping World Truck Series. About to run the JX200 at Dover. See what we can get out of it, brothers. Oh, right, ladies and gentlemen, we're here at the Dover International Speedway. Look how pretty this track is. Oh, are we in the 92 this week? The black tires. Hey, look at us. Look at that. It's looking good in that F-150. Definitely we're not running that. Let's go qualify. All right, driver, dig. Dover is one of my favorite tracks, IRL. From sim racing and everything, I just, I've just always loved this track, and I don't know why. I guess because I, I also like Bristol, but I guess I, I feel like it's a bigger Bristol. And I've always just liked this track a lot. The concrete and everything, it's always been one of my favorites. And okay, today, whenever I'm recording this video, I think it's the 25th, 23rd. Pre-ordered NASCAR Heat 4 today, the gold edition. And I'm quite concerned because I don't think they've made this publicly, but on their website, you, they say you get the gold edition three days early. So if I pre-order from GameStop and stuff, I'm kind of worried they're not going to give me the game early three days. I think they're going to give it to me on the 12th. Let's see where that puts you. So I really, really don't know like what is going to happen with that. I kind of hope they were smart enough. I probably should look at my receipt, actually, and see when I'm supposed to pick it up. But yeah, other than that, I can't wait to get it and play it. Enjoy it. All right, be smart out there. Going green. Be ready here. See what we can get. Green flag Never here, now. Dover. Our goal is 22nd. And we got 17, 17 laps? I don't know. I mean. 14 laps. So I'm going to let some of these guys go, and I'm just going to race smart. I don't have to. I'm going to let them get single file. We have got 14 laps. We'll let them get a little single file down so we don't have to sit there and destroy ourselves to try to get a top 20. And we're already catching Fontaine back. I mean, we're not trying to win races. We're just trying to get the, the goal. don't even know why the truck did that it's so dumb I, I that's something that I definitely hope is fixed in heat for it it looks like it is but I don't know I mean I was under him and we barely made contact and it was just like my whole truck had got hit from the opposite angle See how they're single filing out? That's what I need to get is up here now so we can race single filed out. I kind of hope that's 20th up there. I kind of hope I'm not sitting here in 20 seconds, three seconds up the road. Because I did lose a lot of time when I got into Fontaine. We have ran them back down though, so hopefully. Careful, still there. I mean, I'm under you. I was at your door. You can't just keep coming down. Keep hitting your mark. You'll keep I'm going to take them on the outside, I'm guessing. No, I don't got the truck to do that. Is that Justin Fontaine? I think that is. He needs to move out of the way. Holy shit. Eight to go, and yeah, I'm not getting 22nd. I can tell you that. 
I already feel the tires already slipping away from the back of this truck, and I'm not. Oh, they're wrecking. Oh, he's blowing up down here. Oh no, it's it's uh, Stuart freezing just like real life. I baby these tires too. <sighs> Just got raced like a douche canoe by Justin Fontaine. One of the funniest things I do remember from my earlier heat career is I had a rivalry with. Uh, Sean, I think it's Sean Wilson or Jay something, Jay Wilson or something. It's the guy named Jay in the Dirt Tour. And uh, we had a rivalry. Gordon. We had a rivalry and somebody made a YouTube account with his name and was like, man, you gotta stop being mean to me. I'm a developer. I thought that was pretty funny. Just no tire wear, no grip. Luckily enough, we're going to probably get a good contract when we win the dirt championship because we're on trucks. But right now, man, Dover. I don't know how I have 69 the right front. I barely even ran on it. Damn, the leaders are right behind me. Uh, loose. Look at that. Didn't change anything. It went straight to the fence. We're going to take 30th. Really, this truck. Probably about a 30th place truck. The battle for the lead's pretty interesting behind us. Maybe we won't get involved in that. White flag. There might be a checker flag for them. That was definitely checkered flag for them. They're slowing down. Coming around to finish here at Dover, 30th. We're going to have to get a contract through the winning the championship. Yeah, 87 speed rating. I, I was putt putt, and I don't know how I killed that tire like that, unless this truck was just that bad. That being said, guys, we'll see you in the next Dirt Tour race. Welcome back, guys. Sorry I didn't record qualifying. I forgot I stopped recording and didn't re hit re record. So we're here. We're the race. We're starting sixth at Texas. Actually, I think we're starting fourth. We're on the outside of the second row. Now we're sixth. So we can get up here and win Texas. I need a recovery from. I cut the whole notes off the other motorsports.com car. I need a recovery after that terrible race we had at uh, Dover. Come on. Don't wreck. Well, you got a lot of laps in this series. I don't know why you wrecked. I didn't even hit him. I took a three wide in the middle. Keep your head on straight. Ready? Let me laps. Oh, great launch. Right, Three to go. Boys, can you say how much you love Texas Motor Speedway? 
Keep it going. We run like shit in the trunks, but buddy, we're good on this dirt. Put us in the Mud Summer Nationals. Or the Mud go. Summer Dream. Or the Eldora Dirt Derby, whatever it's called. We'll put your truck to victory lane. Sliding this bad boy around. We're going to go to victory lane because this track has a victory circle. Hell yeah. Could save the engine for that second year of burnout. We got nice our motorsports.com. Car looks. Comparing it to the other motorsports.com car. This this car got motorsports.com on it? I feel like it does. No, I might be dumb. We're going to Victory Lane here at Texas, baby. Bring out the cowgirls. Yeehaw! With well, that being said, ladies and gentlemen, we will see you for the next NASCAR Heat video. More looks like more dirt racing, maybe another hot seat. Don't know. Thanks for watching, guys. Till we meet again. Peace.